right here is good. Hey, Marky Mark, he's with us this morning. Start right here, this is me today. Mark it, take me off the map. Tell him to hit that group chat, tell him it's a wrap. See how fast we can change this prop here, boys. We gotta go fishing. Let's see your head. <laughs> Freaking dripping, bro. Get some super glue on that thing, man. <laughs> this is about to suck right here. You got gloves? Ah, oh, I'm, I'm scared, bro. Do it. Oh my god. He's there. Burn. Dude, look. I got it, dude. Hey, Cody, go put your in the water. We'll get it. No, we're good, bro. We got it. We'll, we'll help you guys launch. Yeah. Dude, we're starting off. Hey, listen. <laughs> we're just trying to get it all out the way. Look, look, look at that. Look at that. Uh, oh, there's no bleed. Uh, oh, uh, get it quick. Uh, get uh, it. Uh, uh, Rick, look. There it goes. What a life. All right, guys, here we are. This is knockout round. We're going out in fourth place. Super excited, man. Found a lot of really good places. Uh, Lake Gunnersville's really showing out. It's going to take a lot of weight to get ahead and advance to the championship round. I mean, I'm thinking like somewhere in the 20s. So make sure you guys follow along. It's going to be fun. Hopefully, we reel them in. Two, baby!
Yes. Yes. I needed that fish so bad, guys. Five, three. Oh, come on, girl. I needed you so bad. Kept us in contention. Look at that bass. Little of a monster. Yes, sir. Come on. I gotta get it back in. Five pounds, fifteen ounces. Five fifteen. Good. Hey, 
got you two really, really clutch fish. Five pounder and six pounder. Be ready to end. Keep me right where I need to be. Huh. Guys, we uh, we lived the fun another day. We just dropped off the uh, official and the camera guy, picked up BJ, and we're actually out right over this T dock because they got a little activation. We're gonna get and uh, and drive through. And the reason why we're driving through is because we punched our ticket to the knockout round, baby. <laughs> Let's go! Give me love. Give me some time. Oh man, what a day! I mean, I started off really good. You know, I caught like 19 pounds pretty quick. And then everybody started catching me, man. Jacob dropped, I mean, he dropped 30 pounds or something stupid like that. But uh, everybody started catching me. I was falling, falling, falling. And the one thing that I realized when it comes to TVA fishing is you better be on your best hole at the end of the day. And uh, that's what we did. We went back to a place that uh, we started at and we caught a six, a five, and another three and a half. Um, and we're in third place. We dropped almost 24 pounds. So uh, pretty freaking awesome, man, to be uh, to be in this side, this top ten, knowing literally nothing about Lake Gunnersville. Um, but if you guys watch that practice video, we uh, we caught them off the place that we found real late in the day, and that's one thing that I can't stress enough is that no matter how tough your practices can be, you got to fish to the last minute because you never know. You never know when uh, when you can find a, a potential winning spot. So tackle direct. Mr. Adrian And then the first day of the competition, I go there and I catch 23 and a half pounds, and I'm like, man, this this spot is pretty special. And uh, today, you know, I started there. I caught 19 pounds pretty quick, and and for a little while there, I thought 19 pounds was going to make it. But then I just kept on falling and falling and falling. And the one thing that I realized when it comes down to TBA Fisheries is you better be on your best hole at the end of the day, the one that you think that had the biggest bass. Because you know these fish just set up late in the day. It just seems like it's like even in practice it was the same way. Um, then I rolled back there and I caught a six, a five, lost another big one, caught a three and a half pounder. Um, and then that was the end of the day. You know, when you're looking at the score tracker, you know some guys have uh, two or three fish and they, they still have the ability to catch two more before they have to start calling. Is the nerve-wracking moment knowing
knowing that the guy sitting back in, in 27th place has got two slots to fill, or is it the guy that's just below that cut line that only needs four ounces, but he's got to catch a 4-3? You know, I mean, the biggest thing is this: these kinds of fisheries are really unique. You know, you can roll up on a spot, and, uh, you know, Matt Becker, he proved it, you know, that with his first day of competition where in 17 minutes he caught 30 pounds, you know. So, uh, I mean, really nobody's out of it, you know, and that's the thing about, uh, about these kinds of fisheries. I mean, look at Jacob. You know, he had a phenomenal day, caught 29 pounds. You know, that can happen to anybody. That can happen to anybody inside the top ten tomorrow. And uh, I really feel like that's what it's going to take to win this thing. Uh, going out this morning, it sounded like there were a lot of tournaments. Was it busy on the water today? You know, honestly, uh, honestly, not really. You know, I mean, um, I had one local that I was sharing a spot with. And, and uh, honestly, I don't think he really, you know, understood what was going on. But uh, he was really respectful, and I was able to fish around him. And, um, you know, I mean, there was some other local pressure, but, I mean, everybody out here is real nice. And, and uh, you know, you, you roll up to a spot and they're on it, they pick up the troll motor and leave. And, and that's all we can ask for is the respect to, to really, I mean, we got a lot on the line this week, you know, so um, hopefully tomorrow's no different. Well, I got to say, your teammates have won a lot of these, and uh, it should be about your time. It's got to be about, you can go either way you want. You work hard all day. Coming up. Yeah, for sure. I'm actually gonna use. I'm gonna use my boat. I'm gonna use my leg. Hey, what's your name, man? Max. Max. You live around here, Max? Do you? No, we actually. We moved here six like years ago years. for this lake. This no is way! Amazing. It's an amazing Where'd lake. you guys move from? Ohio. Ohio. Okay. Yeah, in Ohio fishing. Yeah, it's not bad. Too good. It's bad. So, hey, can you stand right beside us. Good picture. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah. You're good right there. You're good right there. Uh, <laughs> I got you. All right, one, two, three. Hey, this is, yeah, this congratulations. Is a, this, hey, this, well. hey, this is a great place to, uh, to, learn, to really get things dialed in. It's man. so good. This is a knockout round. If I had to pick one guy that's going to throw words right off the rip, it's got to be me, man. It's going to get controversial. Make sure you tune in because it might get wild.